Hello. It's time for God of War. Chris, you are always like ready to go when when we rock into this. So Mamir, why did Freya spin your face? No. Speak of Baldur. He claims nothing harms him. All right, so we're jumping right into exposition. Vulnerability to all threats, physical or magical. The boasting of a god. Everyone has a weakness. Not him, I'm afraid. Baldur is blessed with invulnerability to all threats, physical or magical. You just said that, Mimir. Did I? What is the source of this power? Uh, well, that's recall, probably fine. We can find a way to beat him, right? That's a thing that can be done. Mimir? Parts of my brain must still be coming back to life. Just need a moment to finish waking up. I love Mimir so much. We just phased right through these plants. That's fine. So, we have destinations. Free stuff. It is. It has been a little bit. So, we left off with Kratos having said boy 98 times. Ed, how do we speak to the serpent? There's a horn on the platform at the middle point of the bridge. Take me to it. Finally, got horn. Man, my aim is awful. There we go. I'm getting I'm getting back into it. Uh let's blow the horn and talk to the boy. Good. Now put my lips to the horn. Oh, he's gonna blow the horn. Alright. <laughs> He doesn't have lungs. You know what? Good for him. If this works, this works. Oh. Um. Why is he doing that? Gordon had that statue made in honor of Thor. That seems uncalled for. Absolutely abhors the fat dauber. He was probably sick of looking at it. But doesn't that hurt? Well, he and Thor have a bit of an unpleasant history between them. Or they will, anyway. I guess waking up to see it was worse than the thought of lumps of solid stone passing through his gullet. You know what? We all have people like that in our lives. Our only concern is your time. Dude's got a bassy voice. I respect it. Right, wish me luck. I've still got it, lads. You remember me. This is a very strange language. He knows the pain of your loss. He will help you. I need to, I want to know more about this guy. That is ahead. What is he doing? Making sure we're headed in the right direction. Listen closely now. We need two things to get us into the land of the giants. He, First, that guy, we need to learn the travel route that did not quit while he was ahead. Second, we need to carve that rune into the special gateway. Is that one of the people who first met you? Correct. Except the giants, in their infinite wisdom, saw to it that no ordinary chisel would be. He is so big. Only the tip of a magical chisel. I just want to hop on his head. I know where it is. It's not I want to go hard. climb up on top of him and stand on top of the world. Oh, big mood, Mimir. 
And off he goes. Hey, look! The water has dropped even further. You can see more of the realm towers and statues. I haven't seen new places to explore along the shore. Where is this chisel? Find me a boat, and we'll go from there. Where did he go? Oh, he's just... Okay, he's just chilling up there now. Hey, buddy. Also, hi, Sabrina. How are you doing tonight? Uh, let's put that away. We're not we're not in combat right now. We want to go this way. So when we get to the boat, we can either look for that special chisel now, or go exploring for a little while. I'm happy with whatever you want to do. Oh, <laughs> he uh, he had trouble with pathfinding for a moment. We all have that. Hello, birds. I do like that Mimir just gets to chill out on a seat. Uh, I guess we're headed over there. There's also... what? What is... This is a thing, right? In your face. Well, she blames me in large measure for her present circumstances, and not totally without strength reason. permanently increased by two. I will take it. Back to the long war between the Aesir and Vanir. Prior to that, wars for the Aesir were easily won, but the Vanir had proved their equal and exacted devastating damage. Both sides suffered tremendous losses, and for many of us, quite frankly, war was simply no fun anymore. A rather senseless waste of precious life. Is there anything interesting here? I don't think so. Precisely. Enough was enough. And at last, Odin's most brilliant advisor became determined to find a more enlightened path. Enough. No stories. Not while on foot. Our focus is the road. Completely understand. I'll finish later, lad. Too early. So that's actually something that I really love about this, is that they use the, like the boat trips as a as a way to get like exposition and world building out but like it's perfectly in character for kratos to just say like hey shut the fuck up we have things to do and so they let they let the exposition and and less critical things happen while you're traveling around on the boat but as soon as you hit land they clear room for the characters to talk for story stuff this i swear howdy among the living. That's what they call me. Calls to me. She yearns for peace. Yet her remains lie in pieces. I beg of you, make my Gulvig whole again. I don't know if I have the power to do that. Oh, collecting bones. All right. Gulvig Sather magic knows no bounds. She can reunite you with those you've lost. That's a hell of a promise. How? Boy, I can smell oh, there's one. Grief, child. Rest assured. Her magic is strong enough to create bridges between life and death, if only for a short while. Boy, we are leaving. Another one. We're starting off strong tonight, boys. They've taken three of Sweet Gulvig's bones and spread them across the lake. All right. Bring me her bones, child. Gulvig will reward you. I'll see you later, buddy. Uh, did I did I take the wrong path? Or no, I need to open this up, don't I? Ah, good. The special chisel is ahead past this gate. Ah. We're gonna get those free headshots in, you know? Oh wait, what are the what are these bastards doing here? Excuse you. There's... I don't want to deal with your shit right now, guys. You... 
I need this guy down. And there we go. I just needed to give him a little bit of a... Uh, So a couple little smacks in the back of the head just to remind him who's boss. Spoiler alert, it's me. Where are you? Where the hell did you come from? We were done with you. You know what? Oh, he just a dude at me. Oh, Mimir with the with the helpful pro tips. Uh, oh, did the big guy die? <laughs> the big guy died while I wasn't looking. Make sure my counter is closer so it's easier to to increment it because I'm still going by the rules that I got to drop everything until I've upped the counter and had a sip yeah okay that's that's fair off-screen deaths uh, I've almost made a horrible mistake we're not going all the way back we're going here there we go this chisel we seek. What is it? I'm glad you asked, actually. I have just the story for you. <laughs> there was a giant once named Thamu. A very giant giant. Dude, I want to be a very giant giant. Let's go. Wait, how big is this chisel going to be? to one day pass his vast knowledge onto his son. But young Harimthur had the heart of a warrior. Perhaps the father had too much fear in him, or the son too little. Either way, a quarrel of theirs spiraled out of control, and the overworked stonemason bonk struck his son. Ah, uh, the bonk makes it. Thank you. Into the night, feeling shame and regret, Thamur chased after his son, but in his emotional state, soon found himself wandering Midgard, lost and alone. Sadly. He caught the eye of the one person he didn't want to meet alone that night. <laughs> so, he asked about what the chisel is. Man, what happened next? You'll see. Ah. It's a big ass hammer. Aye. When Thamur fell, he crushed a charming place famed for worshipping the Vanir god Njord. Thor oh, always took credit for planning that one. The truth is, the sweaty ball bag just got lucky. Right, and they time some like these story-related conversations so well that you you basically. I mean, he called it out to me. Oh, he's he's got big ass claws. Uh, are these? Is this a blockable thing, or is this? There we go. Uh, don't hit my son, please. Some of these combos, like, they just feel cruel, you know? Oh.
pop. Perfect. Thanks for the help, Atreus. You're doing great. The tip of one, yes. Still can't do anything with these. All right, fine. Let's get our loot. Is there? The big crystal on the giant's ring looks promising. Well, fine. Darn, that didn't seem to do anything. Well, I mean, it's the thought that counts. We almost got there. Brother, looks like that crystal's brimming again. Ah, right. I can, I can do this. Here, we'll leave that right there for the boy. And we get some free stuff. Dang right, it was totally my idea. Alright, then we'll bring this bad boy over to the left and open ourselves a nice path. We're in. Samur was a frost giant. When he died, his final breath froze everything. Uh, as it does. Oh, interesting. If I if I hold my my melee attack, he does like a uh, an attack that he throws the axe out in front of him and then catches it. That's cool. I like that. Give me more free things. New chest armor. See something up there. Yeah, I, I don't worry, I was getting to it, kiddo. Ah, it's him. The tip of that chisel. That's the magic we need. I love the visuals like this. Like that is haunting. Enemies. Well, One yeah. And I'll find Hup. Crystal. I'm ready. Oh, I was blocking, but or I was trying to block anyway. Dude, this guy's kind of a dick. You know what? I'll just kind of let this guy go ape shit for a little bit. Rip a man straight down the front. Oh, I bounced him off the rock. <laughs> Get up, fool. I'm not done with you yet. There we go. This guy's going to have a very bad time. Boop. Oh, I totally thought Atreus was about to kill him. That would have been great if he'd gotten the final hit there. He, he deserved a win, but... That's fine. He participated, and that's important too, I guess. Hello, welcome. 
we are uh, continuing to to drink on on boy. Boy's doing well. He's he's been you know he's been doing pretty well in combat. We've been uh, oh hold on I might be about to drink. What does it say? Oh no he didn't Sir. he didn't just say boy. Uh, but yeah we've had he said it a couple times already tonight. We started today at ninety eight and we're at one oh one. Calm the winds and seas for the fishermen. For that they loved and worshipped him here. Oh yeah, so we're so we're looking for the chisel of uh an old god, you know? And uh We've kind we've kind of found it. Which like this is this is fine. You come across dead gods with chisels impaled in their heads all the time, right? That's just a normal thing. Uh, I need not that one. Oh, I gotta gotta change my angle so I can actually hit it. Slightly better angle. There we go. That feels correct. Yeah. Okay. So I need the backwards Bluetooth symbol and a little hut. Oh, what's that? Looks like something that can break. Oh wait. Uh. Uh, boy, how do how do you how do you change? I forget how to get boy to change his arrows. Because. I mean, am I wrong? Is it not the backwards Bluetooth symbol? I mean, I guess I guess it came first. But my point still stands. Okay, arrow type is up. The only D-pad option I didn't try. Hello? Oh, don't worry, I see it, boy. Uh, that wasn't the correct one. It's got to be another. There we go. Backwards Bluetooth. And now we just need one more. Ah, okay. I, I I know what I gotta do. Boy. Hit that. I just need it to go away for a second so I can grab another one. Because I did not get as far as a, of a pitch as I would have wanted to. Perfect. And now the little hut hat. Let's go. So now that should be open. Nice of them to wait to open it until I was l visually looking at it. Atreus, follow me. Sorry, I got distracted. Classic child getting distracted all the time. What this? Increases damage of all axe throws by 6%. Damn. That's uh That's my kind of rune. How where do I where do I equip? Is that on my armor? Yeah, it is. Perfect. Actually, how are our skills looking? Because I've got actually a lot of XP. Oh, this is a thing. Okay. Uh... Let's make sure Atreus is is getting real strong. 
Shock duration, shock damage. Okay, so we're going to inflict more shock damage and a greater amount of shock damage again and increase the duration of it. Atreus is going to get real good with those shock arrows. And we now have the ability to lock on to multiple targets with the throwing axe. Oh, how do you get it down, you ask? Funny you should ask. Because yeet. Why, do you, why does he look so sad all the time? Like, I get that his mom's dead, but he's on a fun adventure with his dad, and he gets to kill stuff. There we go. That's more like it, kiddo. Man, I want, I want Kratos to call him kiddo just once. Used to enhance unique properties of various talisman. You know what? Sure. I will take it. I was not expecting that. We reached into the void and drew out loot. <laughs> Move over, you're a wizard, Harry. We need you're a god, kiddo. Hey, big guy. Head of Thamor. Dude's got... Dude's got nose hairs thicker than my neck. How are we getting down there? I have a plan. You do? Do not act so surprised. Oh, no offense, brother. But I don't even think Thor with Mjolnir in hand could get through that much ice. Then Thor is a fool. This should be entertaining. <laughs> Boy. Ready. Oh shit, I have to put down... Okay, I have to take a drink. I have to take a drink. That's unfortunate. Man, Atreus was ready to defend me though. Love that from him. Okay, you need to die. Weirdest. Hey, you can stop hitting my kid, please. Oh. You, my friend. I have problems with you in particular. So I'll just rip you in half, because that's what you do if you have a problem with someone. Oh, he just killed a guy. If my problem with them is you're too hard to rip in half, then I'm weak and that's a me problem, you know? Oh. There's something about Atreus hopping on somebody's back and then me just absolutely whapping the shit out of him. Oh yeah, I've, I'm, I'm familiar. Atreus was just riding on his back? He's, he takes after his old man. You know what? <laughs> Behind me isn't a problem anymore. He 
Here we go. No, we got this. It's fine. Oh, I can't block that shit. Yeah, I'll be fine. I'll be fine. I This happens all the time. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Uh, man, Atreus sounded actually really sad about that. But this is fine. Ow, bitch. I say that as disrespectfully as possible. I don't like when they all gang up on me like that, so if they just didn't, life would be so much easier, you know? Okay, this guy in particular needs to go. Not you. You. Yeah, I'll be good. healing items for a moment. No. I know what you're trying to do, and just don't. There we go. Have one of these. Oop. I love that throw animation. I was I was hoping to catch him on the way down. That would have been so sick. Oh, I caught that on the backswing. Okay. Have one of those. Go, kiddo. Okay, I'm mainly focusing on this guy until... Here we go. Now this will be much more manageable because I can just simply... Shit. Oh, that guy just yeeted a man at me. I don't need to watch anything from here. What are you talking about? Bop him. Bop it. Oh, not necessary, dude. One down. Just... Just this guy remains. Do a little chop. And now we can finish him off. That was... This is fine. We'll just... Keep hitting him with the heavy attacks. 
and a light attack to finish him off. Yeah, probably. Well, that actually went swimmingly on the second time. Sindri? Oh, hey. You oh, hey, buddy. Nice of him to give us a path forward. I probably could have thrown Atreus up there. He would have been fine. Wow, that was uh, something that that fight. Catch. Well, that was a waste of a perfectly good hour. How were you not seen? <laughs> there is nowhere here to hide. Oh, that. It's a little trick my people can pull. A special way of not being seen. I want that. Be invisible? More like I can step into the realm between realms. And your mind doesn't understand what it's seeing, so it sees nothing at all. That's how we avoid all right. having to actually use the weapons we craft. It, uh, it doesn't seem to work on dragons, though. <laughs> Your brother wanted to know if you're getting enough to eat. I guess I could tell him you are. Brock was asking about me? Was there meat on his breath? <laughs> You let him touch this again. The, I love the rivalry. They're just so mad. But they work so well together from a distance. Come on then. Wait, these guys did remote work before it was cool. So that's how Brock was in the temple right after the water. He stepped between worlds. Okay now, shush. I need complete silence for this. To hit it once with a hammer? There you go. Oh, I love every time that that's, that's all they need to do for it. Let's get to it. All right. Surtur's Grip of Flame? Grants Wrath of Flame on any low activation chance to grant Wrath of Flame on any successful hit. Greatly increases strength, restores a small amount of health, and fires a wave of energy on normal attacks. How do I get Smoldering Embers? Because I need it. Ooh. So... Do we upgrade Atreus? Hmm. Yeah, he's just a little guy. I think it might be helpful for him to, to be like a, a support. Or do we just spec him into fighting on his own? Because he's gonna have to he's gonna have to grow up eventually. Support seems nice. Ah, what more do you need? Yeah, okay, I need a I need to figure out a smoldering ember source because it looks like a lot of the higher level stuff requires them. That's good to know. Ah, I can just buy runic attacks and enchantments from these guys as well. Oh, I'm gonna get a I'm gonna buy myself a resurrection stone so that I can actually come back to life sometimes. And yeah, I think I am gonna get Atreus into support. And for the youngster. There you go, kiddo. Now, I can afford a Talon Bow upgrade as well. Oh, that's that's what they call me. Any... no, no axe upgrades. 
Okay, I basically can't afford any significant upgrades. I might... Oh. Defense. My new chest armor is actually much better. What do you mean if I'm not in a hurry? Uh, hold on. I got chest armor that... is just a solid improvement on some of my stats that I care about. And we'll just drop Mark of the Ranger on that. Ooh, although... That's actually huge. High perk activation chance to grant a health burst on any successful parry. I'll see if I have another... I'll see if I have anything else that can fit a socket. I do not currently. I might honestly take that over having increased axe damage for now, because that's, that's kind of huge. We're going to be so healthy. Okay, we're going to save up for Atreus upgrades with our XP for now. All right. We have we have a our upgrades figured out. Can you guess it? No, and you. It doesn't involve sending it here. Correct. But how do we move forward? Boy, Carmo really liked Drulos, didn't he? Even braided his beard with it. I happen to think he looks dashing. You know, for a snow-covered course. Okay, so we're gonna have to... Oh, come on, boy. Can't you shoot a moving target? There we go. You can move it whenever you want. That's kind of a thing you can do. You'll be fine. We heading into that building? Yes. You think there's something inside that'll help us break the ice and get to the chisel tip? No. <laughs> I'll keep thinking. Oh, no, no, no. Kratos isn't worried about anything in here helping us get to the chisel tip. Because he already knows what's going to get us there. Wait, what do you mean right behind you? He's directly in front of us. Is this dude backing up? You know what? Yeah, fair enough. He... This guy's a bit of a dick. He's just turning around. This guy's got some some moves. Come on, do it. Oh, hey. Asshole. I see you up there. Oh. Atreus, absolute hero. Oh hey, none of your none of your bullshit today. I'm glad that that swing didn't quite get to me. Oh, uh, that seemed effective. <laughs> you got him right in the tummy. Oh no, not the tummy. So I can't survive a second big hit like that from just Atreus healing me, but I've got, but I've, I've got enough to survive on, just barely. So 
Oopsie, I'll be okay. Especially once I do this. Oh, and Atreus hopping off my back to help finish him off. Bitch. This game is so much fun. Like the the combat is is tough, but like once you get the hang of it, it just it feels so nice to get the combos like that off. And yeah, that that dude was that dude was a turtle. Uh, there we go. Oh, I'm going to want that not all the way over here, but I'm curious. Nothing at all, lad. That's the tragedy of it. They took no side in that madness. But there we go. Paranoia is the past only by Thor's lust for blood. Yeah, yeah, the the bloodlust. We all we're all familiar. Everybody's got a little bit of bloodlust in them. It's just a known thing. No, uh, hold on, I, I'm not telling him to, I didn't tell him to go that far. Okay, there we go. Oh, no, not, not quite what I intended to do. I want to... I guess I want to be over here. I need this to turn around somehow. I would... Uh, because I need to be able to go over there. Uh, how did that work? I have to be honest, I don't quite get it. Okay, so it only has two rotation options. I'm not sure I entirely understand what I'm supposed to be doing to make that work. Can I... I can't give it a delayed throw. Because it's not, it's not a thing that I have the power to do. I can't throw it while I'm on here. Okay. I was just trying buttons. You didn't need to shoot me, Atreus. That seemed uncalled for. Alright. I'm not entirely sure what I'm supposed to do there, but I will survive without one pickup. I don't want to spend four years trying to figure out something. We could have just as easily hopped over here. Oh, but it doesn't seem like that was the the path they wanted us to take. Hold on, I gotta... There we go. Perhaps we're going over this way and around? Yeah, that seems right. And then up here. And over there. And up, and we are golden. Atreus, do your thing. Ah, uh, we'll figure something out for this. Here. Ooh, you got most of it. 
There we go. Second time's the charm, as they say. I I don't remember much from my first playthrough of this game, but I remember this. We do must. Why are we going up when what we need is all the way down there? Thick. Well, <laughs> the chisel tip is under thick layers of ice, so melting it won't work. Correct. And there weren't any shattered crystals nearby for me to shoot, so that's not an option. Correct. That just leads smashing the ice. We need something ridiculously heavy to. Oh, <laughs> I get it now. Good. Let's go, boy. Turn the hammer so it lands near the chisel tip. Not possible. We cut it free, write it down, and figure out what comes next after. So your plan involves a whole bunch of luck. You're welcome to suggest a different one. <laughs> Kratos just does not give a shit about most things, and I kind of respect that about him. What now? Hold tight. Oh boy, onto what? Uh, the plan seems ill advised. <laughs> Don't worry, that's within the acceptable parameters of the plan. You forget, boy, I'm Kratos. Ooh, actually, now that I think about it, does that armor accept runes? It does not, but it increases my defense by like 25%, or er, by a third. It is now a quarter of my defense. There's a sand hole, but how do we get to it? We cannot. I just punched the shit out of that pallet. Look here. I guess I'll I guess I'll wait over here. Keep up the good work, boy. What does it say? Symbols. The seasons? Yeah, but the order goes on. Shouldn't it be autumn? Why is it winter? It's from a song mother. Uh don't I know that one? He said backwards, right? Quiet head. Winter, spring. Summer. Autumn. Okay, I guess we'll I guess we'll do it the way they said. Oh no, it, it does have to be backward. Okay. Winter. I didn't realize I had to talk to the boy. Winter, spring, summer, autumn. Now try. Uh, backseat allowed means if, for, within reason, if you know what needs to be done in a section and I'm struggling with it, I don't mind having a little help. Um, so like in cases of like if I'm playing through a game and maybe there's like a really cool collectible that I'm not going to find on my own and it doesn't seem like I'm on the path that I would find it. I don't mind somebody hopping into the chat and being like, hey, you should you should head over this way and, and like pick up this collectible. It's really cool. You'll like it. Um, but I don't want people doing is telling me like 
if I'm if I'm still trying to figure something out, I I would prefer people wait until I ask. If it's especially if it's story related stuff. Well, turns out stopping time keeps the sun and moon from streaking across the sky. Unfortunately, it does not stop the wolves that chase them. Yeah, no worries. Um, yeah, it's just kind of a general thing on Twitch. A lot of streamers don't tend to like. Uh, A lot of streamers don't tend to like when people backseat, so I like to specify that, like, for the most part, I don't mind it within reason. It's kind of an unwritten rule for most streamers that if, if, unless they say it's okay, just don't backseat. These guys are very easy to beat the crap out of. I'm just gonna send him right down. Bye. Oh, I love cleaving guys in half like that. Oh, thank you. I, I, I try to keep things as positive as I can here. Um, so I'm, I'm glad that, I'm glad that that comes across. And I appreciate you coming and hanging out. It's 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 always more fun for me when I've got people that I can chat with, because really, I the main reason I do this is because I love sharing my experience of playing through games with people. I've always liked like playing games with a friend and being able to just talk about what's going on, and this just kind of feels like an extension of that for me. Stream hangout time is. Amazing. I am always a fan. Wait, did I punch that one guy so hard that his buddy got stunned? Ow, stop hitting me with fireballs, please. <laughs> Being held hostage by the chat is just an extended hangout time. That guy's right off the cliff. Stop. Please stop throwing fireballs at me, sir. And you stop hitting my son. All right, there we go. Yeah, this is this is wholesome times. Don't worry. You cut that out. <laughs> uh, <laughs> bye. Yeah, feel feel free to come hang out in the Discord. Absolutely. I um, admittedly, I am not as active in there as I'd like to be. I'm gonna I'm gonna work on that. Ow! Who? Oh, you. Oh, I've been flashbanged. Something about sending these guys right off the cliff. Oh yes, um, I would I would greatly appreciate if anybody wants to. In my Discord, there's a a game design document that I've shared. Uh, in the in the big announcements channel, I believe, uh, for a game that I want to make this year. So if if anybody's willing to read through it and offer some some feedback, if if things look good, if you have ideas for things you'd like to see added to the the idea, I would absolutely love to hear thoughts and opinions because uh, I plan on getting started on it before the end of this month, if I can. Okay, I'm kind of... Ma'am, can you chill out a little bit? Just please, thank you. Oh!
maybe I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> I think I just shattered the floor underneath us. Oh, do I have to start from the beginning? Oh no, we're near the top. We're near the top. Ow, what just hit me? Oh. There we go. That takes care of some of them. So I'm on a time limit for some of these guys, it seems. Can I not get her? No. I need her to go, please. How do I... How do I get more energy? I just need her to die faster. Ah, uh, that's not good. Okay. So I need I need to kill those guys much faster than I've been killing them. Which is a problem because I don't know. Okay. So I need These guys are pretty insane. I wish I could just tell Atreus to keep reading and I'd defend him. Because he deserves to, to feel safe, you know? Go ahead, kiddo. Do what you gotta do. Oh, he just did a thing. Oh, that guy just fell on his own. Come on, I just need her to get a little weaker so I can... There we go. We're set. She was, she was the main problem. Anything else is secondary. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, no, as, as soon as that lady was gone, I knew we were, we were good. Because she was the thing that, she was the last thing standing that led to our death both other times. Hey, guys, that's my son. Uh, oh, uh, Atreus, shoot those, please, real quick. Uh, maybe actually hit that one. Maybe. This is a very shaky platform, I understand. Alright, we just barely made it. Uh, the game file that I want you guys to look at, let me, let me double check here. So, in the Bread Cult, uh, Discord server... Under general announcements, uh, the, the channel general announcements, there's a link uh, in the most recent post there uh, to a Google Doc titled GDD Unfeeling Rug 2023 Name TBD. Uh, so that's just a, a, a thing that I wrote up describing a game that I want to make this year. 
or at least start making progress on this year if I can't finish it completely. Oh, the, the boy. Gotta take another drink. But yes, I will I will keep my son safe, do not worry. Well there it is. How are we going to get it free? A push. Trust me. <laughs> oh yeah, you were in you were in general, General. Ready. Dig in and push with everything. Oh, I like that he's asking Atreus to help. <laughs> it's like when you it's like when you're playing a game and you hand your kid a second controller that's not plugged in. He sounded so excited about that. Wait, he just left Atreus to hold on to it on his own? Confirmed, Kratos is cracked. <laughs> what a what a perfect line from Amir. Thank you, buddy. Well, the plan seems to have worked. The chisel did. Give the man credit. He has a talent for destroying things. Remember that head. Never leaves my mind. Oh, I see I see free stuff over there. Bring it to me. Uh how do I That's fine. These things happen. How do we know they're easy? Because that hammer didn't fall on its own. Well I'm gonna let those two talk for a second. Not now, I'm looting. If it's so important, it can wait until I've done ransacking this grave. Hello, gents. Oh, they're not living gents. They're just... They're the echoes of gents that once were... But I mean, to be fair, they were going to be that anyway when we were done with them, so we just kind of skipped part of the process. Those are the guys we saw with Baldur, his nephews? Aye, Magni and Modi, the sons of Thor. Mother always said the Aesir were the worst of gods, and Thor was the worst of the Aesir. Guess he's a terrible father, too. They are no longer children. <laughs> wait, they wait. Have no excuse. Will Sindri be okay? They'll never even see him. <laughs> Hold on. D Atreus, don't think I didn't notice you dropping that. He must have been a terrible father, too. I'm doing my best, okay? <laughs> I'm sorry. Ah, the great dining hall. Envy of all Midgard. Funny. I remember there being a massive candelabrum. Really alive enough. It's probably around here somewhere. Man, I can't believe... I can't believe my son... Yeah. Well, that worked. You just can't help but break things, can you? I'm only a dad in the game. Uh, to to this guy, he's he's my boy. But oh, uh, I see you up there. Hold on. We're not done with this yet. Here. Do your thing, kiddo. You know, for being called the Stonebeard King, he looks like he has a very icy beard. I'm gonna punch him in the nuts. <laughs> Perfect time for Loon and Gang to show up. 
right after I'm gonna punch him in the nuts. Hey everybody, welcome. Oh my goodness. <laughs> welcome. All right, so for everybody who uh, is here and is not aware of Loon, go check her out. She's fantastic. Uh, how has everything been going tonight, guys? How is how is Dark Souls treating ya? Wait, wolves? Oh, yeah, can confirm. Those are wolves. That's that's fair. I I appreciate you coming by as always, Loon. You're wonderful. This guy's got nothing on us. I'm gonna punch him in the butt cheeks. Kick him in the back of the knee. Uh, dog. Sorry, but... Oh, hey, he's there. You know what? Here, I got this for him. Oh, you got through in Orlando? Man... The, um, so that, that fight, uh, I, I was doing that fight during Extra Life, and actually Chris was around for this, because he was coaching me. Um, I suffered on that fight until like four in the morning. But I got them, on like, <laughs> an unfortunate amount of sleep. Got him. But man, that is, that is such a fun fight, and it, it's it's going to be very rewarding when you when you get them done. Summons a stampede of spectral boars that trample enemies in their path. I hope he summons fourteen boars. That is a very specific call out that will only make sense to a very limited number of people. Uh. Man, I, I'm glad you had a good time though, Loon. Uh, what am I, what am I busting around here? Probably not much. Oop. I'll just get rid of that. Are we? Which direction am I supposed to head from here? Can we go up? Oh, I can probably break that. Yeah, it's this is just a very this is a very nice area. That there's people in there. Ready yourself, boy. Oh, not just Oh shit, he said he said boy. Hold on, I have to take a drink. Oh. Got got the controller back in hand just in time. That was a little stressful on the timing there, because I was just watching him get ready to hit me. Alright, I did not count the boars, but he certainly summoned a good number of them. Fourteen is a real possibility. I do like that they... I do like that they take a break to let me pit fight this one werewolf thing. You know what? Hand to hand combat is the way to go with these guys, really. Hold on, don't shoot my boy. Stop trying to shoot my son. Well, I guess my son's shooting you, but stop trying to claw my son. Oh, thanks, kiddo. And we can finish him off right here. Up, up.
All right, well. This worked very well. But, uh, for those of you who came through in the raid, sorry, I was a little distracted when you came in, but hello to those of you who don't know. I'm Unfeeling Rug. I'm Damien. I play a lot of video games, uh, most of which I play poorly, but I do my best. And we just, we generally, we just have fun around here, you know? We, we hang out, we chat, we talk shit about my poor decision-making skills. And, uh, generally just have a good time all together. So if this is your first time around, welcome. I hope you enjoy yourself. And, uh, welcome to the bread cult. Uh, don't throw boulders at me while I'm talking. That seems entirely uncalled for. Oh, a trace is just hopping on his back. Thanks. All right, we're gonna hand-to-hand -hand combat this guy. There we go. Can I get him to clear any path here, or nah? All right, there's. Doesn't seem like much that he's gonna let me do. Oh, I thought I shielded that, but that works too. I just got him with the nut tap. You know what? Oh, I got him on the back swing of the axe. Perfect. Alright, and now my path is open up here. Let's go. Found the king. I killed him. It was all me. Something ahead. See, lad, he's fine. Thought it best to vanish when Thor's idiot sons showed up. Yeah, that makes sense. Uh you got anything for me? Oh, wait. Oh, this upgrade gives it a rune slot, which is exactly what I've been waiting for. Okay, so that's that's one thing covered. Still can't upgrade the axe or the bow or the quiver. And those are really the main things I cared about upgrading. Okay. Was there? You tell me. Uh, so, we're going to go to the sockets, and we're going to toss in. I think we're going to keep pumping up my, my survivalist stuff. So we've got one thing that gives me a chance of just getting a healing burst if I successfully parry an enemy attack with the shield. But this will also grant me protective barrier, which I think will prevent damage from the next enemy attack when I when I successfully parry. So like I'll heal and prevent the next instance of damage that comes my way, which is a nice combination for a guy who gets hit a lot. And here, we'll get Atreus massively increased arrow damage because I like the sound of that. I've been waiting to find out how to get to this chest, and now we got it. You, n you never want to disappoint father. Hey, gentlemen. Hurry, brother. We may get a piece of the chisel and be gone before they even notice. Ah, uh, there he is. Look at him. Oh, okay. Good thing it's a cutscene. Surrender. The old father demands it. No. He's kind of he's kind of chunky. 
this fight is mine, boy. Go. And where do you think you're going? Oh no, brother. The little freak's got a bow. What are we gonna do? <laughs> uh, well. No, I don't think so. Don't touch my boy. Man, Atreus just coming in clutch. Don't gloat as if you're succeeding here. You know what? I got some I got this for a reason. I could just send him right off if I tried hard enough. If only. No, you won't. Oh, that's great, because that attack was supposed to hit me. Oh, uh, no, thank you. I almost had them stunned. Oh shit. What does Odin want? Oh no, don't care. Come here, Hathri. You're done all night. I love this so much. Like this This part of this fight is just the right amount of tense. Oh wait, he said boy. No. Alright, we good. Stop touching him, please. Just a little heal for a second. No, leave him alone, perhaps. <laughs> Sorry, he was just laughing so hard. I'm just gonna focus in hard on Magni and see if I can get him stunned. No, 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 no. Leave him alone. That was concerning. Okay. need him down just a little bit. Yeah, I, I'm aware, kid. So I need them both down at the same time, which is a whole thing in itself. Because it seems like... There we go. There we go, we'll just kick him in the back a couple times. Oh, I just went right through that electricity. Alright, here we go. Round two of this. Oh boy, here we go. 
And he's succeeding. Almost got him. Hey, I see I see you out there. Uh, oh. I saw him out there. This is very distracting. Yeah. The kid's got a lot of uh, anger, and he is more than ready to beat the crap out of somebody with a bow and arrow. Oh. Boy. Alright. Nice of him to stand there and let it happen, honestly. I respect that. Uh, seems like time for this. Man, he is a grumpy kid. Thank you for the freeing, Atreus. You know, it's really satisfying to just beat the crap out of him with my bare hands when he has to use a sword. Please let go of my son. That would be greatly appreciated. Get that shit out. And boop. Atreus coming in clutch with the arrows in the back of the head. Uh-oh. You know. You, have no idea. you know my reputation. He's... He's a little grumpy. Sickness. Fever has returned. No! It hasn't. Roy. The coffin, the blood. The boy's sick, he needs Freya. No! Steady. I'll be all right. Hmm. We'll see. We'll see how well this holds up in court. Fine, see? All right, so... We should keep an eye on him. We've... We've done it. We've killed one. Oh, and we get our frozen flame. Look, I know we've just murdered a man, but I can upgrade my axe. And that's what really matters here, I think. Actually, on this note, before we go any, f any further, Atreus did really well, so he gets an upgrade. He earned it. Now he can shoot even faster. Oh, we're almost there. Oh, we're just going to break it off with our bare hands. Alright, cool. Isn't that a little hot? Sure enough. Should do. With that, we can carve the travel room to Jotunheim. Get you where you need to go. Oh, incidentally, all those magically sealed doors we've seen can now be unlocked. Like, like this one? one? You can get through that door there now that you've got the chisel. 
so, oh, yeah, that feels about right. All right, about here. Okay, cool. You killed Maggie. That he did. He was a god, <laughs> but you killed him. Minor Aesir, perhaps, but I. And his father is Thor. Not minor, not minor at all. Him. <laughs> yeah, th thanks for the update there. Well, in Asgard, I defended us. Nothing more. I fear no judgment. Judgment, no. But if vengeance is any concern. Since when can you kill a god? <laughs> uh, it's kind of been my thing for a while. It's a quirky little thing that I do. Just for funsies, you know? Oh, I see you over there. There's two more around here. Oh. Funky. I just want to make sure. There's got to be two more around here. So there's one there. And there's one more chilling out somewhere. One more, like, urn to destroy. And once I've done it, I have earned uh, the loot. Maybe I have to drop down here and it'll be... Hi. Uh, where... If I was an urn, where would I hide myself so that I wouldn't be destroyed by a madman with an axe? Because there's something purple in there. And I want it. I need it. But I will give up if it takes me too long. We'll take one more look from up top, and if we don't find it... Then we don't find it, and that's just how life is sometimes. <coughs> oh well, I suppose... I suppose I just won't have that loot. That's a shame. But, it happens. Oh, we we know we know which way back. Don't worry. Uh, hey. The travelers. Oh, disgusting. Mm, smelly, covered in God knows how many little beasties, but gorgeous armor. Let's see if I can't make something more sanitary. <laughs> yes. Oh, very well. The business. All right. Now, Leviathan Axe Upgrade. Oh, huge strength. Huge. Now things are getting wild. Oh, Frozen Flame. Chilling Mists of Niflheim. Eh, we'll find that eventually, I'm sure. I assume we'll have to go to Niflheim for that one. But I don't know when there's the next time we'll be passing through. All right, let's get through some doors. So, then keep up. Yes, sir. Oh, no, I pressed the wrong button to open the door. You ever try to open a door and instead just back away entirely? To struggle. Hey, I just realized. Magni didn't come back to life. 
is interesting. <laughs> it's known the AC have find their own way to Valhalla. No Valkyrie escort, no processing at the gates of Helheim. That may be significant. Hmm, this may also be significant. We're gonna find it. Oh. That's step one. Or step two, I guess. Here's step one. So we're gonna chuck We're gonna do that better this on the second attempt. We're gonna get the kid to shoot it. Hopefully. There we go. We'll take that back in a second, but first we'll drop one of these on this chest and have him do the same thing. While that's blowing up, we'll grab this and bring it back. Change his arrow types so that he's ready to blast it too. Bless you. We'll retrieve some loot from the void. Dust of Realms. Yep, we're back. Perfect. I like that he's just standing there very patiently. He's a good kid. If a little grumpy. He probably gets that from me. Fisherman would bring the day's catch into this port and use that contraption to send some of it directly to the Jarl's main kitchen. The rest are sorted and sold. Oh, hold on. There is an exit under the thumb. Find a way across. Well, yeah, of course it's moving. All right, uh, boy, over here. There is an opening. I can get it. Thank you. See, we couldn't do this journey alone. There's a path to the exit on the other side. Are you on the Are you on the platform? Hope you are. Or wait, you can you can let me up. Uh, Atreus. Oh, uh, maybe he can't get over there. This kid is sneezing up a storm. Oh, yep. Okay, he he is there. All right. I wasn't sure if he made it on yet. I guess we're sending him back down. I don't know. I'm gonna climb up here and see what's going on for a sec. Or am I exclusively supposed to use that as a means to get back down? Because if so, that's a little awkward. Hold on. Because it didn't let me let go of this when I had it up top. There we go. Now we can climb up, get on, pull our axe back, and gravity should pull us down to the other end. Woo. Bless you. There we go. And now we'll kick this down so we have a safe path. No, we're not taking the path. We're, we're just having the path. Bring me to the exit. Oh, <laughs> sorry, the little. When he doesn't get it right, like just listen to this. <laughs> I 
I'm so close to it as well. It's right there. There we go. It just sounds so, like, anticlimactic when you don't get it on the right spot. Back under his palm. We're almost there. Alright. Uh, this all just drops a little bit of money when I do it. Killed a god. What do you think mother would say? Bet you have come a long way. Thanks. <laughs> She'd say, sick. What now then? Maybe Freya ought to have a look at the boy. No, I feel better now. I just needed to catch my breath. Mm -hmm. Well, now that we've got the giant's chisel, we need to learn the travel room to Yacht Knight so we can carve it into that special gateway atop the peak. An open realm travel to the land of the giants. You don't know it? Alas, no. But the serpent did mention that the giants had entrusted that secret to Tyr. Isn't Tyr dead? Aye. But his hidden vault is very much in reach. I guess we're going into Tyr's vault then. Submerged in the lake for generations until our snake friend shifted his weight. There we shall find the fabled Black Rune of Jotunheim. We could also explore some more. We got that chisel now. And that vault isn't going anywhere. Seems a shame to waste the boat. We shall see, boy. No, oh, hold on. Take a drink. Back to it. Lemire, you were in the middle of a story before. So, how did this advisor of Odin's try to end the long war? He set about to broker a peace between the gods. Oh yeah, I forgot that he was in the middle of a story. Persuaded to marry his deadliest enemy. A certain Vanir goddess, legendary not only for her fertile beauty, but her genius at the very Vanir magic that Odin had long aspired to master. Ooh, a marriage of convenience and function. It was a sacrifice to protect her people, a selfless act of love. Truly, she deserves better than she got. But of course, there's more to that story. What is fertile beauty? Uh, that is a great question that I feel I am not, uh, equipped to answer myself. Uh, this looks like the vault that we're going to. Ooh, here's vault is behind that magical lock. Well, good thing I have a magical key. Bonk, and... Perchance, perchance also bonk. There we go. Oh, a third one. Oh, uh, right about there. All the other ones have been two, but this one was a little extra security. Okay, Veer, you're you're not wrong. <laughs> I just hate that you're right. What's behind door number two? Oh, it's just the other side of the building. I don't I don't particularly care. Let me back in. All right, to the vault. Yeah, you you came Go ahead. at an awful time, Loon. Come look. Let me show you how to read this. Oh, that is not necessary. You've taught me so much. We're gonna learn from the boy. <laughs> you know that's completely fair, Talon Scout. <laughs> Andreas. Come on, you already speak it. Learning to read won't be that hard. Oh, the boy's gonna teach us how to read. Just not this tongue. You're halfway there already, then. Okay. So the runes represent a lot of different things. Some gods, some animals. Wait. Some... Oh, am I going too fast? <laughs> Not that. You smell something. The that was brutal. Was was I going too fast? Yeah, I do. 
Was the concept of words and animals too much for you? Oh, Loon, you might want to... Have a good time, Lynn. Have a good. Joke. But if I kill you, no one's gonna laugh at me. Oh no, he's quick with the shield, just like me. That your father's doing? Or did you get it from your mum? She's stupid and ugly. Shut up! Oh, the knife come out. He got he's got the Spartan rage. Let's go. Never mind. Oops. Mostly got broken. <laughs> well I mean it's only fair now that I get to break you. Stay back. I will not. Make you eat your own mace. No. This isn't over. Dude, quit let running, me, dude. Just let me finish you off. Brother, the boy. Atreus. I do like that he keeps calling me brother. You have to get into Freya quickly. There's no other way. Oh, nice of him to leave the door open for me, at least. What a gentleman. I got 4,500 XP for that? Hold on. The kid needs to... Oh, I can't... I can't upgrade him. Okay, I'm gonna... I'm gonna save that XP for when he totally gets better. And we're gonna... We're going to give him a, a new level of archery skill as like a, a get well soon gift, you know? Take the boat. Freya's isn't far. Oh, the sky. Uh, yep, that's that's Mimir. He's he's a friend. Man, look at that. Very ominous shit. Uh, but yes, that, that head on the boat, he's just chilling on the seat. That's Mimir. Uh, he's a friend of ours. We get along swimmingly. Smartest move, and if anyone can heal him, it's her. What is happening to him? I've seen it in mortals, some conflict of the mind. Yeah, we're we're scooting, we're going fast. Never God. I could do side quests right now, but <laughs> I can only imagine. We're almost there. Imagine if this whole time Atreus has been like pestering me to do side quests. And the one time I finally do them is when he's completely unconscious. <laughs> he's like, yeah, you know all those odd jobs people were asking us to do? We, uh, we went and got them all done. Well, I did. You had a very, very long nap. But no, this is, this is a little more pressing. So we're gonna, we're gonna make sure he's okay.
He's breathing very raggedly. It's weird to see Kratos, like, nervous like this. He's pacing, he's... uneven breaths. But we're almost there, we just gotta make it to that door. He is shaking. It's serious. We must hurry. I'm still a god, go away. The boy has fallen ill. Bring off. He's ill. Man. Sorry, he was very no ordinary illness. Very worriedly what shouting that it's urgent. True nature fights within him. And she's just she just says go away. a rare ingredient found only in Helheim. The keeper that protects the Bridge of the Damned. I need its heart. Hmm. Hell. The Realm of the Dead. Do you know it? Well, this one. It is a land of unyielding gold. Fires cannot burn there. No magic in all the Nine Realms can create a blaze. As for the dead, your frost axe will be useless. You'll need to find something else. Oh, I completely forgot about this. Then I must return home. Dig up a past I swore would stay buried. Who you were before doesn't matter. This boy is not your past, he is your son. And he needs his father. This room opens the bridge to Helheim. When you are there, do not under any circumstances cross the bridge of the damned. There is no road back. Understand. What if I do it anyway? Hey, Mille. You must hurry. Through my garden, there's a path leading to my boat. Take it. Return home. Dig up your past. Do whatever you need to do. Just bring me back the bridge keeper's heart. And your son may survive. No. Yeah, because now he's tempted. He's like, but what's on the other end of the Bridge of the Damned? When last we spoke, I was... No. You were right to distrust the word of a god. No need to explain. Not to me, not for that. I will keep him safe. That's a mother's promise. Are you saying you want to be his mother? Because, uh... Hey... Helheim of all places. Oh, this is her boat? I will do what I must. Leave me be. That's such a cute as boat. A I want that as my permanent boat. But I also don't want to steal her boat. <laughs> I I mean, I guess if anybody in this game needs that descriptor, it, it, I guess it would be her. It would make sense. Kratos is also... A fertile beauty of a completely different vibe. This boat just propels itself. It's... That's fair. So this is temporarily my boat. I'm not keeping it, but she did say I could use it for this specific purpose. Ah.
This is fine. Now there's that one deer again. The funky horns. This weather seems like it's completely normal, right? I do like it's easy to tell here on the on the back of the axe the two runes that I have slotted in like their symbols and everything are there and that's just a really cool thing that they have like a like an in-game indicator that you have runes slotted into the axe because there's actual actually a physical spot on there for them Oh, you... I even saw it coming. Guys, this is not the time to mess with me. Portmanteau of smoosh and crunch. In case any of you were wondering what my thought process was there. <laughs> I don't need to worry about from behind. I mean, I'm in a kill animation, so I'm good. Oh yeah, these guys are immune to my axe. I thought I blocked that, but alright. Oh, did that not kill him? That's unfortunate. That would have been great if it had. Oh. He, he went for that attack, and it did not go well for him. It's time. moment that maybe not all but some of you have been waiting for distance between you and the truth as you want it changes nothing pretend to be everything you are not 
teacher, husband, father. But there is one unavoidable truth you will never escape. <laughs> you cannot change. You will always be a monster. Monster no longer. It's time. These are such a cool, like, weapon and attack pattern and everything. Also just Oh, I'm not I'm not good at the range attacks on those, but like just being able to like pull enemies to you. over there in your own front yard no less take the shortcut back to the realm travel temple then on to Helheim yeah yeah no the the whips like the whip blades sick absolutely a huge fan um one thing I feel like I'm about to sneeze I'm like I don't want to start a long sentence because I feel like my urge to sneeze will become overwhelming right in the middle of it but it's fine. So I've had the thought. I guess we're headed to Brock's shop. Um, I've had the thought. We have the rune to open up the portal to Helheim. We have been told that Helheim is a realm of unbearable cold. Anything you'd like to get off your chest, brother? I'm gonna let this conversation run out. I can assure you, I'm unsurpassed in keeping confidences. Well, you know where to find me. And for the record. I'd already guessed you were Greek. Athena, dead giveaway. Um, fair enough. Bring me the door. Thank you. Um. So we have we have the travel rune to Helheim. We've been told Helheim is a realm of unbearable cold. And uh, I guess my stream title is inaccurate because. We are now cracking open a cold one without the boy. Nor will it ever be. Son, my brother and me created Mjolnir for the big idiot. I know from quality. And them? Them special. So, I don't know, I don't know the lore of God of War prior to this game. But I'm pretty sure... I don't know if he was working for Athena. To like wipe out the other gods. Is mine. Now I, my responsibility to make I do base that entirely off of him saying, "I am a monster, but I'm your monster no more." Say, what can I do to help? I can do things. When I should tag along. Dude, I would love a road trip with Brock. Is enough. But I understand that Kratos doesn't want it. Such a hurry. The realm of the dead. Helheim? Shit, this is serious. 
Yeah, that's why that's why I'm doing it. Uh, those aren't exciting. Berserker's Resurrection Stone. Revives Kratos from death with full rage and a small amount of health. Okay. Okay, there's there's nothing too exciting from here. We could upgrade our chaos blades later. Okay, frozen flames and chaos flames are two different materials, which is good. Yeah, there's a there's a lot going on with basically all of the all of the gods of all the various pantheons. Oh, the symbol for Helheim is the the symbol that's around the O in God of War. Like in the in the logo of the game. Helheim. Let's go. I love the visuals of this every time. Like whoever was in charge of like the visual language for just this the entire Bifrost, I love them. I want to give them a smooch. Like, look at that. What a... What a visually stunning thing to just bust out of nowhere with no warning. Dude, I could never be a virgin goddess. For... For two reasons. Thanks, Brock. Thanks for coming to Helheim with me. Let me take this moment to tell you that what you are about to do is absolutely insane. Oh yeah, this is known. Odin can survive this cold. So I hope those blades work. Yeah, this place this does look pretty spoken. cold. No, we're still on the realm travel bridge. We're after the bridge of the damned. The dead use it to cross into their permanent home, the city of Helheim. The bridge keeper who minds admission, he's the one we want. Let's follow this bridge. Should lead us straight to him. You know, I really hope never to see this place again. I was about to ask if he's been here once, but I realized that Yeah, I guess I guess he would have been. Because for a short time at least, he was very dead. So if for no other reason, he would have had that. Use the fire of your blades to burn away that hell's bramble blocking the path. Oh yeah, that's a thing I can do now. Two reasons. Uh, so the first being I I could not be a goddess. The second being. Anyway. Uh, burning away the bramble. We're gonna focus on that. <laughs> Wait, why is why is Mimir lecturing me on on why I went back for the blades? That was my choice, buddy. It... These guys have some weird attacks. Yeah, life's got a weird leveling system. <laughs> Ow. Will you cut that shit out, guys? Thank you.
Hello. <laughs> Life is just so grindy. Great, great pun. Ten out of ten. The gate must be closed, and if the gate's closed, then it's true. Hell's full up. Oh, that's probably partially my part, my fault. Listen, if hell's full, there's only one reason for that, and it's this guy right here. Hello, everybody. Come with me, everybody. I'll find you another way in. Anything down here? Or is it just... Alright, fine. We'll very slowly make our way over. Hello there. Let me out. There we go. I like that guy's shield. I'll take it. Maybe I won't take it. <laughs> the little dink. Well, that guy did not react. Uh, how do I... I forget how I block attacks. Or I how to break an enemy's block. I have I have a thing for that. Double tap L1. Come on. There we go, that feels better. I'm gonna break some bramble while I fight these guys. There we go, exactly as I planned. Yoink, yoink. Uh, I guess I'm climbing this. When we killed the Reavers near my home, they came here. How did they return so quickly? Time doesn't move the same between all realms, especially where the spirit world is concerned. Like the light of Alfheim? The opposite, in fact. The Lake of Souls feels faster than Alpine time, but Hell is much slower than Midgard. Sorry, I'm sure... That actually works out for us. We will be back to my son all the sooner. That is good. Ah, aren't you a quick study? Oh, don't worry. I was way, way ahead of you on burning objects above me. Hold on. You... Oh, I kind of felt bad for that one. But also, it was kind of sick, so no, I don't. Uh, okay, so I burned that side of it. I need to get on this side and burn that bramble. There we go. I don't know, blocking the javelin with the shield and then immediately punching the dude in the face with it? Oh, okay. I get it. Oh. Oh, I was ready to block. And then I got hit with a javelin. Come on. Oh, I was a little late on that javelin block, which is a shame. Come here. Oh, that's a ranged return attack. 
This changes everything. Oh, wait a second. Wait a second. Those dead of disease, mishap, age. It is dishonorable to grow old. Well, never too late to go out fighting, I suppose. Um, earlier when we talked about how time moved slower here compared to the 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 regular plane Midgard, he said, "The sooner we get back to the boy, the better." Uh, I missed it at the time, so I'm gonna take two drinks or two sips to make up for my errors. Because I must atone for my That's misdeeds. We can reach it. What do you mean if we could reach it? I could I could totally jump that. Here we go. I have a feeling I'm gonna be knocking this over. Or maybe not. There's got to be something that I've missed here. Let's get back down for a moment. Just got to reach that somehow. This exists as a destination that I can get to. But it felt like that was just to get at Odin's Raven earlier. Hmm. You're really telling me I can't jump and grab that? Is that... Sure. Okay, uh... Got to find a way that I can reach. That one spot. There's something that I've been missing. Oh, there's there's brambles there. Brambles are usually a good sign. Ah. Yep, that'd do it. Actually, while we're doing this... Uh, okay, I do have a runic attack. I will take that. And I don't have anything for heavy... Okay, let's let's do some blade upgrades. We've got we've got Yank. We'll increase immolation, which will power up the blades and inflict burn damage on every hit. I will take that heavy attack, absolutely. And we'll take both of those. Luna's here. This is the reminder to stretch and hydrate. I'm not sure if she's around because we're getting into a lot of story stuff and I know she doesn't want to get spoiled. But, Loon, if you do hear this... Yeah, do that. Actually, hold on. I'm gonna. I'm just going to DM her and say... It'll be one less obstacle for the living to reach the inner sanctum of Helheim. Who'd be mad enough to go there? There we go. It's made it to Loon. I just messaged her to say Rice says stretch and hydrate. <laughs> oh, I see you dead boys up there. Oh, that sprinting attack is so cool. Uh... 
Oh no, I need the boy to get at that. Alright. Hello there. The bridge of the damned. And there's the keeper, making sure the dead are really dead. What is that he holds? That totem contains a powerful source of magical energy, the very power of Helheim itself. I want it. You want is his heart. Just take it and we can leave. Yeah. Easy. Start some trouble. You can do that, right? Howdy. Ah, uh, he's locked the door. I want to I want to talk to that big guy on the other end of the bridge. Now. healing item right here. Okay, so that stuns him just a little bit. Okay, I need to I need to work on that. you don't want me to be. He's contracting dead people? He's just kind of letting me do this, isn't he? Try to dodge that, but I did not succeed. Don't worry. I got it. Did he just get himself with those? I need this thing. And I'll take this while I'm right beside it. You can't get me, coward. Oh, that guy pounced at me, but he messed up. I don't think he was expecting the return fire. I, I fully wasn't expecting the return fire, I will be honest. It seemed to indicate they were coming 
Yeah, <laughs> Matiger Helson. I was not intending to use that attack, but I will take it. Absolutely. Matt, it's your time. Oh, why did he teleport away right when I got my return fire? Dick move, dude. It was so cool. Uh... No. I know what you're trying to do and you're not allowed. I'm coming for you, buddy. What are you gonna do to stop me? That's right, nothing. Will you... He's not gonna sleep with you if you keep defending him. Hello there. Oh, first time getting somebody with the blade. It's a very similar animation, but... Ooh. Except that part. <laughs> That's great, Veer. Yeah, it wouldn't be the first time. I want to know what's up with the bird. Get him. Are you going to make me do it? Are you going to make me hit the button? Yeah, you are. I gotta earn this. Usually it's a lot easier to rip out people's hearts. This guy made me work for it. But it is real tempting. Oh. Zeus? Hey there. My father. Your father was Zeus? Well, that explains a lot. <laughs> what is that place? Never go there. Understand? Okay, but now I'm really tempted. How is he? That is not possible. It's just an illusion. Hell's known for torturing its inhabitants with their own past. We should focus on getting back to your son. I hear you. But, on the other hand, the bridge is right there. You know? No, the bridge, is the bridge broken? No, oh. Damn it. I see you. You made the smart choice to break the bridge if you didn't want to fight me. But still, b bitch move. I'm gonna stomp those rocks in anger. Oh, what's this? <laughs> hey. It's cold. Real quick, give me your blades. Why? I said I'd help you in aim too. Come on. Very trusting. Uh, my equipment's in Midgard. Be right back. Yeah. You don't suppose he met those, do you? <laughs> there. And now they're ready for the winds of hell. You couldn't have done that like a second ago? Before I fought the big guy? 
Winds of Hell are very unstable and can only be held for 10 seconds. I sometimes wonder if there was once some sort of accident in his brain. Oh. We have been away too long. I want that kind of power to just disappear even when somebody is directly looking at you. Hello, the dead people. Oh, okay. They're probably fine. Am I taking the winds back with me? Howdy, gents. I love when they scream. Don't... Don't read any further into that than specifically those enemies crying out in pain when I hit them because I hate them. As the only context in which I meant it. Uh, and I can't do that because the boy isn't here. Alright, there we go. Uh, take that. Put it over here. Chris, how could you? Oh, say bye to that guy. All right. Uh... Oh, I can't take this one with me. Fine. Sorry, brother. I'm still stuck on what I had back there. Zeus was your father? Not now. And she <laughs> focus on getting out of hell. And with that, I cannot argue. I'll just contemplate that little nugget in silence then. <laughs> yeah, contemplate those nuggets, boy. Uh, oh, here we go. I need that. And I'm gonna put it here. Just kidding. Can't do that. I need that. Gentlemen, I have opened hell. Zeus is a lot of people's father. You're not wrong. Dude's, dude's gotten up to some, uh, some funky things in his time. And I, I fear his energy, you know? Not everyone should have that kind of power. Especially not him. He has proven he does not use it wisely. Right, I'm gonna yoink that, bring it all the way over here. Up. Oh, is that just a in-between point to drop it off? Hi. Oh, AOE attack. Never. Tactical retreat isn't in my vocabulary. Oh, of course I get my wits back right before. You can't beat me, buddy. See? I win. What is... Oh, 
Cool. Gift of strength on every successful kill. See, I don't retreat. I only advance towards future victory. Uh, these guys. I'll pass, thanks. Oh, the kill animation on them. <laughs> True. Uno reversing is a solid strategy. Alright, uh... Right there. I need to bring one there. Which means I can pull one from right here. Run, 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 run. I don't entirely know what that was supposed to do, but I'll take it. Oh, you know that's that's true. That's a good it's a good observation, Veer. Oh. I was hoping that was like a ranged Will you guys cut this shit out? Thank you. I thought I was done with both of you. Fine. Uh, that. Give. Thank you. Now back this away. I'll just kind of... <laughs> yeah, there's got to be a lot of animosity. Stop that. You are my least favorite. There we go. Yeet. Oh, there's something just so, like, primally satisfying about just absolutely hucking one of those little nightmare things. They deserve it. Oh, there's a, there's a spot for a thing here. Where is the nearest... Repository for them, though. Oh, there's one. There's a spot that I can drop it off up there, which should. Hey. Bitch. They do deserve to be Yot. Even though we aren't in Jotunheim, I will Yot that guy. Okay, so I want a time limit here, but I can drop it off in the back of this thing. Then I can pull it from there. Bring it here and drop it off in this ball. I want to figure out where's the... Where's the in-between spot? Right there. Because I got to figure out where I can safely bring it, drop it off, continue carrying it from, so that it can get to its destination on time. I am nothing if not a dedicated delivery man. Five, four, three, two, one. With point two seconds to spare, not quite apparently. Apparently I did not pull it off.
That was unfortunate. There we go, for real this time. Now, okay, so when he was able to like push down Thor's hammer like that, that was a that was a very heavy thing. How tightly are these chests sealed that he struggles with them? Because I can't imagine that that chest was sealed more tightly than that enormous hammer was stuck in place by inertia. Oh, that's true. I didn't consider that. What do you think I'm trying to do, you weird little dude? Actually, while I'm here... Don't worry, kids are tough. When I was his age, I cut my own head clean off. And I'm none the worse for wear. Huh? You... You what now? <laughs> you know what? It's not... It's not my place to question it. I'm just real fucking confused. Uh, you know what? Let's take this. We'll get a, a pommel that lets me rage burst on successful kills, potentially. There we go. I like Spartan Charge, so I'm gonna pump it up. Ooh, pressing R2 after dashing performs a shield slam follow-up that launches enemies into the air. Huge. All right. We shouldn't delay, brother. It's straight back to Midgard with that heart. Well, what do you think I'm doing? It's what I'm here for. Straight back to oh, to return to Midgard. Press triangle. We're going home. He tried. Say nothing to the boy. Oh, he said boy. No, I love respectfully bollocks as a line. Mimir is truly an icon. Hey, so you know that shortcut between realms? Well, I made it better. Yeah? I might have broke some. We use that. I know you do. So I took a few cuss from them winds of hell and made it so it ain't just one way. Now you can use it to travel to and from. If I didn't break it, then we can take it to Freya. There's an idea, brother. Let's go. Might be some kinks to sort out, but you'll make it. Just go, brother. I don't want to hear about your kinks, Brock. That being said, let's let's get it over with. Well, you gentlemen certainly know how to get around. Very, uh, very quiet journey. We'll make it there eventually. Yeah, I mean, some things get better when they're broken. Like Kit Kats. You had one chocolate bar, but now you have two.
I'm trying to think of other examples. Uh, glow sticks. Right. Yeah, but close enough. He did say there were kinks. We must hurry. Sup, I brought you a heart. Dude, I'm giving her... I'm giving her my heart. Oh, she just, she just bare-fisted that into the boiling water. Eats Kit's cat's whole? Veer. You know what, fair enough, you do you. It, it's not for me, but... But what if you just told him? Perhaps. Did I tell you that I have a son too? It's been forever since I last saw him. At his birth, the runes foretold a needless death. The babe in my arms was so small. So helpless. I knew right then I would do anything to protect him no matter the sacrifice of course everything I did I did for myself I let my needs my fears come before what he needed and I couldn't see his resentment until it was too late don't make the same mistake have faith in him. I know the truth isn't simple, but nothing is when it involves your child. Solid advice from Freya. It is a curse. The boy has been cursed. Bad timing for you to wake up. The process of having a child just kills the nerve endings in your hand. Is he not? Is he well enough to travel? For now. They will harbor again. Uh, about that. the closest thing they're going to get. Freya, I will not forget this. <laughs> Message pops up in the top right. Kratos will remember this. Your father did the heavy lifting. You should stay, recover. You have done enough. Don't try to adopt my son. You know my door is always open to you. But we could talk about being a stepmother. That's Vanon, isn't it? You figured that out, did you? Well, the window looks like Bifrost Crystal, and I know that's not what's on the other side of the wall. And, Funky. Well, it makes you sad. You are wise for one so young. Yes, this is a window to a home I left long ago, but it is only a few. The thing that happened to you in Alphon. You can't leave Midgard, can you? A gift from my former husband upon our separation. Why would Odin trap you in Midgard? Petty cruelty would be reason enough for him. That tracks. With all his rash decisions, he's driven by fear. The Vanir were the greatest threat to the Aesir until our marriage brokered peace. Many of the Vanir now think I betrayed them. The fruits of my sacrifice. To be hated by my own kind... To trap me here is to ensure I can never make it right. Damn. That sucks. Um, so I was wondering, why 
Why do you live under a turtle? <laughs> <laughs> a much less heavy question. Here in Midgard. He offered me shelter, and in return, I provide him with protection against the evils of the forest. That sounds like a nice arrangement. Giant turtle? You sure have some interesting friends. Golden Boar, God of War, Green Goose, Guava Juice, Giant Snake, Birthday Cake. Is that... Is now a good time to peace out? Alright. See you later. Now then, before Modi so rudely interrupted us, we were just about to explore... Yeah, on the topic of Modi... Uh, the Black Rune. Boy... Do, you know do we get to kill him yet? Oh, I don't know. Sure you do, lad. We need a boat. I don't know. I guess we need a boat. Okay then. To the boat. He's uh He's looking a little sad right now. You you good, kiddo? You need a reassuring pat on the back from your old man? Maybe not. But let it never be said that I didn't offer. Oh, I, we're not getting off there. Sorry, wrong floor. Ah, see? The boat washed ashore. Someone did call a serpent earlier. Get in. I will pull. You are quiet. Are you not better than me? I guess. He's got... He's probably got questions. I you overheard my talk with Freya. You think you understand, but you do not. I mean, he I woke up nothing. to me saying he's cursed. You said I was cursed. You think I'm weak because I'm not like you. I knew I was never what you wanted. But after all this, I thought maybe things were different. You do not know everything, boy. No. But at least I know the truth now. Hmm. Truth. <laughs> not, not quite. Truth. I am a god boy from another land far from here. When I came to these shores, I chose to live as a man. But the truth is, I was born a god, and so were you. Boy. Have you nothing to say? Um... Can I... Turn into an animal? <laughs> can you... Turn... Into an animal? <laughs> the confusion is so real. No, I do not think so. Mother now? She was a god too? No. She was mortal, but she knew my true nature. I'm a god. Why did you wait so long to tell me? I had hoped to spare you. Being a god, it can be a lifetime of anguish and tragedy. That is the curse. What sorts of things can I do? Can I fly? Or turn invisible? <laughs> I no, don't know. <laughs> I feel like a god. I do not know the reach of your godhood. But over time, you will learn. Oh, we're bonding with the boy. 
You are welcome to surprise me. Is this why I hear voices sometimes? Are you sure you've never heard any? Not as you do. That's no surprise. Every god is unique. So, maybe I won't get strong like father, but I'll have abilities all my own? You already do, laddie. Your faculty for language is extraordinary for one so young. Oh, he's the god of nerds. Got it. So you knew all along? I did, lad. But I've known more than my share of gods. Me too, apparently. I wonder who else knew I was a god. Freya, for sure. Brock and Sindri? They do not need to know. Boulder! Does he know? Is that why he's after us? Do you know him from before? Oh boy. The day of your mother's funeral was the first I ever saw Balder. That is the truth. Hey, we don't have to go right back to Kier's vault. Do we? Oh, but we're right here. We're gods. We can do whatever we want, right? What do you really feel like doing? Going to Tears vault. <laughs> Let's try this again, without interruptions. So he's going to be way too cocky, right? I remember almost nothing about Here we go again. Read it. Death itself I swallow to spring forth life tomorrow. Oh, I like that one. I wonder if I wrote it. <laughs> Sorry, the bounce. Um Was there, uh... Is that the answer there? Says Earth. Hmm, swallows death, brings forth life. I mean, it makes sense. You give it a shot. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. Yeah. I wish I'd known I was Can not I... enough. Kind of a crappy oh, riddle. I felt so bad about killing so many elves. Well, I'm not sure that's the lesson. <laughs> You've done nothing to regret. The elves forced their affairs upon us. No, I get it now. We had god things to do. And they were in the way. Dragging us into their little problems. Again, uh... just leaving that there? I mean, just knowing we're gods makes me feel so much stronger. Maybe you feel a little too good right now. With power comes a big choice, lad. You can either serve yourself um, or your Uncle Ben. Godhood in the service of others, like Tyr did. People really loved him, huh? Aye. A god of war, but one who fought for peace. Had a reputation for being heroic and lawful, using his power and knowledge to stop wars rather than start them. So there are good gods. Once in a moon it's been known to happen, yes. It's it's rare though. There's a reason I'm around. Tia believed the mind, not might, was key to preventing war and chaos. And he also knew visiting other cultures would give him perspective staying in one place could not. While Odin always... He went to a lot of interesting places. Tia was open to sharing with his last his wisdom. For this, mortals adored Tia, showing their love by bringing him gifts the world... Okay, it does spin with the floor. Good to know. I'm glad you also appreciate bonking the axe. Odin came to regard him as a threat to his rule. He suspected Tyr of collaborating to aid the giants instead of helping to steal their secrets for Aesir. Same thing he accused me of, frankly. Though in Tyr's case, I believe he was right. You think Tyr was helping the giants? I do. He felt responsible for the suffering visited upon them by Odin. I suspect he had something to do with helping them cover their tracks. The missing Jotunheim now. Whatever happened, Where's my axe right now? It could only have been done with Tyr and the giants working together. There it is. Oh, a hydrate for Michaela. Thank you. This one's for you. Ah, delish. Uh, nothing, nothing to investigate here. All right. Where is it? I don't know. I've never been in here. Yeah, first time for everything. No, that has to be it. Ah, this place seems. Safe and not at all boss fight location y. Naturally. 
Naturally, of course. I wouldn't expect anything less. Gotta get... Alright, well, uh, Vault's defenses. Is that a chest I can open, or is it just there? It's just there. Cherry once again? Yes, indeed. Some... Oh, this looks like... That looks like a friend. Yeah, uh, Cherry Peace Tea. It's tasty. Oh, are we? We're going up. All right. What are we looking at for security? Oh, there's a hint. Mr. Pitkey. What of these? Thought is faster than wind. Solving problems with our heads rather than our feet. Me fine. Hmm. Ah, here. A way to get back up more easily, should we fall. You know, for someone so loved, here sure was paranoid. Ah, thanks to Odin, for good reason. Okay, uh... Odin is kind of a dick. I think that's kind of his thing. Like this is a this is a known quality. Is this just We can just come back down now. I should not go into the hole, no matter how tempting it may be. Oh, this looks like something. For the winds of hell. But where do you think the winds are? The winds of what? Oh, we forgot to mention that. When you were sick, we went to Helheim to get your cure. You did? Terrible experience, by the by. Your dad picked up a new trick, though, with a little help from Brock. Brock was there, too? Yeah, we had a whole road trip. We'll get back to this later. New knife? Yeah, I see you. Oh, he's just he's just gonna have fun with that for a little bit. All right. Okay, so a spot to put the winds. Oh, is that a spot to, from which to take the winds? Indeed, it do be. All right. So, yeet. Move it or you may lose it, brother. Did I just get old timey move it or lose it? Yeah, that was something. Uh, Something I brought up near the beginning of this stream. There's a there's a whole running bit. Uh, every time we're traveling between one place and another. Look, small passages on either side. Perfect for the boy. Uh, whenever we're yeah, whenever we're taking the boat around. Uh, nailed it. Yeah, so every time we're traveling around with the boat, uh, Mimir tells stories to like fill the time. And then when we're get when we get to shore, Kratos basically tells him to shut the hell up. <laughs> and that's how they separate. That's how they like interrupt the dialogue so that we can do the story dialogue. And then next time you go back to the boat, Atreus asks Mimir, like, oh, you were saying earlier something about this. And then he'll resume the story from where he left off. Usually, like, a line or two earlier. So that it, like, reminds you of where you were and what he was talking about. Oh, oh man. That, that urn in the background has art of Kratos on it. And this is like Greek vibes. Knock it over. Don't let the child see. Unleash your inner hero of Hyrule. Smash that jug. Maybe there's money inside. Oh. <laughs> Enough distraction. We 
I forget why we are here. Okay. That's a great helmet for you, kiddo. Should keep that on more often while I'm finding hints of my past. Oh no, he didn't break it well enough. That's my great desert land, very far from here. Do gods live there? Oh my, yes. Many, many gods. Oh. Good or bad? Oh. Not as simple as that, I'm afraid. <laughs> Uh, I see. Uh, okay, so what is the way to handle this? Because there's this that I need to fill up with the the winds, but I have no winds to deliver. Oh, here this might be. Howdy. True. Oh, don't worry. I see him, kiddo. There's nightmares here, too? Come on, guys. Don't shoot my boy. I still loved earlier, I don't remember what set it off, but I like knocked an enemy backwards and the act of knocking him backwards uh, stunned another enemy that I could do a finishing move on. I'm just doing like doom finishers on everybody. Come here, coward. No, don't go for him. Focus on me. Oh, Atreus went to save me. And just ate a sword. Come here, buddy. You know what? Oh, he, he got hurt. That's unfortunate for you, buddy. Can't believe we got through that. I can. What okay. did you see in that box that set you off? It is not important. Didn't it want you? It was a rash impulse. You need not dwell on I need, I need that. I need that. Wow. That was almost an apology. Well, <laughs> I guess you do like to smash pottery. Ah. I think it's this way. It's not this way. Fuck. Oh, it was this way. One, zero. Focus up, boy. <sighs> Hup. That worked. Okay, I'm gonna need that back. Comes down right here, and we'll grab. I'll grab this health while we're here. Look, I just want to know the truth from now. Okay? I don't care if it hurts me or not. I want to learn. Uh, <laughs> Just because you hate being a god doesn't mean I have to. 
More small passengers. I know. Go. I can't watch, brother. Good luck. <laughs> Nailed it. And I thought those songs were scary. Oh, what do we have here? Look, it's the wolf giants. Skull and Hati. That's right. The bringers of day and night. Man. Oh, that'll be. Oh, that'll be fine. I don't know. Like them well enough to cover a massive wall in his vault with them, though. Uh, I'm sure that won't be relevant in about one game. Don't you enjoy it at all? Being a god on an adventure in some amazing place. Maybe mother wanted us to have a little fun. Everything we've seen and done. Maybe it was her gift. Maybe. It's a big that's a big maybe though. Hold on. I love that I can use these guys to stun other enemies. Like I can just, uh, I can just grab, please grab little dude and use him to flashbang everyone else in the room. It's, it's pretty foolproof. True. But that's fine. Look, there's the wind trap. Oh wait, I think I know how to handle this. So if I grab this, I can't I don't have enough time to bring it down with me. But I can drop it in one of the outer layers that spins that I can grab it down here. And I believe the one I'm looking for is right there. So howdy. Alright, uh... Hell yeah it is. Oh, this is fine. the right boy the middle moon on the left sun on the right we got in the middle oh shit right middle bar oh middle bar left boy okay i think i'm going to i'm going to count it cuz i thought he said boy How the hell do I... Silver wolf eats the moon. Oh no, I've got I've got it completely wrong. Uh, Kratos is just gonna die. I think. I've I've made a horrible mistake.
Well, Come on, get up, brother. I'm not sure I can. All right, we'll do this for real this time. I I misunderstood. I thought I didn't even look at the wolves. So I need the golden wolf to eat the sun. Uh, so. Okay, one and two. Uh, another boy. Hold on, I'm gonna need to. There's gonna be a lot to unpack here. I've made a, another horrible mistake. No, don't keep pulling the middle. That's not what I was aiming at. Oh my goodness! All right. I'm gonna, I'm gonna die. Middle, quickly. Right. Left boy. Okay, I'm gonna. No, are you? I, I was so close. Okay, hold on. I gotta I gotta grab a new can. <laughs> Cause that was a lot of boys at once. I've been muted the whole time. That's unfortunate. Thank you for calling that out. I think I muted when I cracked the can and I forgot to unmute. So, whoops. But thank you. I know. But it saved you. That was cunning, boy. Oh my goodness. So I took two... I took two pretty big swigs in order to make up for all the all the boys that I missed earlier. This can is that I just opened is more than halfway done now to make up for the sheer number of times he said boy throughout that sequence. Oh, you don't have the knife. Boy. Yeah. On the day you were born, I made two knives. Mixing metals from my home and from this land. One for myself. And when you were ready, one for you. Today is 
is that day. Oh. So I'm a man now. Like you? No. We are not men. We are more than that. The responsibility is far greater. And you must be better than me. Understand? Say it. I will be better. This weapon, any weapon, comes from here. But only when Timber like this. Clavicle. Lack of discipline. The self control of the one who wields it. That is where the true strength of a warrior lies. You must never forget that. Good then. We've done it. We've acquired rock. Blank. Uh. Wait. Not quite. Uh oh. Hey, I called that earlier. The room. Did you see it? Yes. Are you certain? I got it. Trust me. Grendel of the Ashes. Aim for the face. Yeah, no. Th this game is incredible, and there's a reason I wanted to... Grendel of the Ashes and Grendel of Frost? I have a feeling I'm going to need a specialized tool for Grendel of Frost. But I could just beat the shit out of both of them, really. Um, yeah, no, I... There's a reason I wanted to replay this one before I got into Ragnarok. Thanks for the warning, but you were a little late. Oh, I can just damage both of them. Oh no, Grendel... Ash Grendel doesn't take well to fire attacks. I gotta, I gotta remember my Pokemon type advantages, you know? We'll focus on Frost Grendel first. Can't see a dang thing. Well, you, you keep trying. that against against Ash Grendel. You buddy. Okay, so I'm glad I'm not the only one who thought of the word Grendel when I saw their names. I'm gonna get him right in the gooch. He's gonna die on top of exactly where his brother died. I assume they're twins because they're Grendel and Grendel. He was big. But no match for us gods. He's Oh. <laughs> troll. Yeah. I'm turned around. Which way is the sandball back up? Great question. Oh. Ooh, free loot. I'm easily distracted. All right, that's that's pretty handy. Protective barrier when using a certain attack on an enemy. Alright, let's get the hell out of here. Yeah, he, he uses that knife for a lot of things. Did he expect he just wasn't going to need it? Or I guess he just figured he'd he'd sort it out. We're so close to the end. 
That's meta. After this cutscene, I am gonna call it for the evening, because it's been it's been good fun. But I feel like I don't have enough time to finish the game. Hydrate from Toast. Thank you very much. This one's for you. Man, he really just slammed back the rest of it. I respect it. <laughs> well, now he's just flexing. <laughs> Sorry, I just love... Downs the entire thing. Tosses the jug. Waits for it to shatter. Looks him in the eye. Uh... Father? Why did you leave your home and come here? Does it have to do with the other gods there? In a way. It's just... You hate the gods so much. The tear proves that gods can be good. And you're good. You only killed those deserving, right? Ah, but who's worthy enough to judge? Quiet, head. We are. We know better. Oh, boy. Huh? Sounding more like your da by the moment. Ready. Ready. Come. He's a very, a very cocky boy. I think I'm going to like being a god. It's concerning how quickly he thinks he's adjusting to this. Alright. Well. We're getting close, guys. We do what we want, and now we're gonna go see the giant. Hold on. I gotta learn that travel room to Jotunheim. We can now head back to the gateway on top of the peak and put that magic chisel to good use. Nobody's getting in our way this time. Okay. We've so we've still got some stuff left to do. I, I don't think we have enough time to finish it tonight. So, next Tuesday, as long as nothing else stops us from streaming, like it has quite often, unfortunately, uh, we will be finishing God of War. Uh, until then, I guess this is where I'm going to leave you guys. I appreciate you all coming around and hanging out, as always. Um, we are going to go hop on and see Sleepy Ken, I believe. Because she is currently playing Breath of the Wild. Oh no, she's she's just gone offline. That is mad unfortunate. Damn. Alright. Well, I guess I guess that was my one idea of who was gonna who we were gonna raid. But uh I guess if we don't have that, I'm gonna just let you guys disperse on your own for now. So, as always, thank you guys for coming and hanging out. It's been fun. I love just hanging out and playing games with you guys. Hope you enjoy the rest of your night. And I will be back, I guess, next Monday to continue with the Lugia grind. And conveniently enough, next Monday, while it is Pokemon Day, it's also Pokemon Day. <laughs> so it's going to be Pokemon Day, Pokemon Day. So I'll see you guys then. Thank you guys for coming and hanging out. I'll see you then. Bye-bye.